Local efforts to save the honeybee are spreading throughout Metro Detroit. And today, we find an interesting connection between a busy manufacturing plant in Plymouth and thousands of busy bees. While you might think the two have nothing in common, nothing could be further from the truth, as Paula Tupman found out. Of course, the workers at a manufacturing plant are as busy as bees, but wait until you see the 20,000 new workers added at this manufacturing plant just since this weekend. At Argent Tape and Label in Plymouth, they make labels. Automotive labels, pharmaceutical labels, food and beverage labels, labels. A small woman-owned company with 23 employees. Over the weekend, that number jumped to 20,023. And there are two new queen bees on the premises. Right there is the queen. We're not going to hold the queen because we got to keep her really safe because she's probably the most important bee in the hive. And the beginnings of a new production line at ATL. Honeybees and honey. We were taught as kids to be afraid of them. So it was it was really an awakening to be able to be that close and that personal with the bees. It's uh it's rather exciting. You, you feel like you're in a coat of armor. You know, it allows you to get up close and personal with the guys. and They land on you and you know, buzz around their face. Just the latest company in Plymouth to see the natural connection between bees and business. And you can see the, pa the path that they fly. They fly the same path. They go out. They come back. I always look at it as, oh, look, they're going to work. Oh, they're coming home. So they've had a full day of work. There's a lot of similarities between the beehive and a manufacturing plant. The bees are very, very busy and, you know, they go out and forage and come back and, you know, build the honeycomb and make products uh, just like the manufacturing plants is here. Bees in the D have placed numerous hives at businesses throughout Plymouth. In fact, throughout southeastern Michigan as a mission to protect the region's food supply. It's going to help with pollination and just awareness about bees and, and the plight that they're facing. In fact, everyone is really invited to do their part to protect the food supply, and it really is easier than you think. Uh, businesses and homeowners are encouraged to install a beehive. If you can't do that, the very least you can do is also plant milkweed or other pollinating plants so that you can encourage bees, birds, and butterflies. But mostly, you just have to think about it because this is everybody's Buzzness. See what I just did there? Buzzness. Paula Tutman, Local 4.